what is going on everyone? It's V here and back with a slight delay for part two of my manga pickups for September 2017. So let's get right into it. We're going to start off with Assassin's Creed Awakening Volume 1. Now I just I did want to state real quick now this part of my pickup video or new series but um anyway so Assassin's Creed Awakening Volume 1. I actually this was a spur of the moment pickup. I went to Barnes and Noble one day because I was in the area of my local Barnes and Noble store. You know, I was running some errands and stuff like that. So I figured out what the heck, I'll just go over there, see what they got. And this happened to catch my eye. And I am a huge Assassin's Creed fan. I think I mentioned that in a couple of my videos. But this appealed to me immediately. Um, and then I, the artwork looks really, really good. Um, if you look at it here, it they did a really good job of making it look, you know, like anime, manga style-ish, but still keeping with the Assassin's Creed formula. Um, but anyway, this was a really good volume. And this one in particular, this is based off of the Black Flag video game. So if you like Assassin's Creed Black Flag, you'll definitely like this. And next one, what is this? A Japanese volume. Yep. Um, this is actually uh, the manga adaptation of the Ponyo movie by Studio Ghibli. And I actually picked this one up when I was on vacation in Disney World last month. And I, I, I know a little bit of Japanese, not really enough to go through a Japanese manga. But I just thought this was so adorable and it's full color. Like, there's no black and white whatsoever. This is completely full color. And that appealed to me right away. Um, so I went ahead and picked it up. I wanted to pick the rest, pick up the rest of the volumes for Ponyo. I think there was only like four, so it wouldn't have been that much. But I just settled for the first one for right now. And I'll pick up the rest next time we go. We might be going back next year. It's hard telling. All right. Next up here, we actually have an anime blu-ray and this is the one piece strong roll movie which i have yet to watch as you can tell by the plastic wrap but i got this on sale from amazon for about 10 bucks so thumbs up on that one <laughs> and then this next one here is the death note all-in-one edition plus the volume 13 data book i'm not gonna really go into too much detail about that but quick story about this one um I've been wanting to get into Death Note for quite a while. And when I heard about this all-in-one edition, I was really, really intrigued. Because um, my plan was eventually just to pick up the box set. But I kept hearing about this one. And basically what it is, is just as it sounds, you got all 12 volumes in one book. And as you can tell, it feels like a brick, pretty much. Um, I really, I like this um, slip cover here though that looks really beautiful but one a couple things I do want to say about this um, I actually bought this retail for $40 and I know a lot of people are probably gonna say oh you spent too much on that yada 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 which I, I probably did in a sense but if you look at it though $40 for 12 volumes I mean you're looking at just a little over three dollars per volume so and I know on Amazon you can probably get it for like 20 or 25 bucks which, you know, I, I probably should have waited and just picked it up there, but I was just really intrigued. I had extra money, so I went ahead and bought it. Um, but this is actually a lot better quality than what a lot of people might think. Um, it's definitely not like those Viz 3-in-1s, those cheapies. Like, uh, I know there's one for Dragon Ball, there's one for One Piece. Um, I know they recently came out with a Baroni Kenshin 3-in-1. Um... But yeah, the quality is not like that at all. I'm actually going to do a separate video on this, and I'll explain it a little bit further. But I absolutely love Death Note, <laughs> and I held off on it for a while just because I didn't know if this was something I could get into, but I absolutely love it. Um, I'm on what will be equivalent to Volume 5 right now, and it's, it's awesome. It's really enjoyable. And this next little part here was actually a surprise. Um, my birthday was in September, and this was actually a gift from one of my best friends. 
she had a bunch of manga that she wanted to unload and these were volumes that I was going to buy off of her anyway but lo and behold she surprised them with me or su surprised them with me I can't talk today surprised me with them as a birthday gift so I'm just going to open this up and as you can see it is volumes oh get up there volumes one through 30 of bleach and actually volumes 2 and 19 I actually had to buy because those were missing um, but we got that and then we also got the 2 and one omnibus for Astro Boy now these volumes are used obviously you know some of them are not in the greatest condition but it was a birthday gift they were free I'm not going to complain um, I tried getting into bleach a couple of years ago and I read like the first couple of volumes and just really couldn't get into it, but here lately, after I've dug in, into it a little bit deeper, it seems really good in the beginning, which I hear the first part of Bleach is absolutely awesome. Some of the best in Shonen manga to date. Um, and then after, I believe it's called Soul Society arc, after that it kind of loses touch, but I'm ready to get back into it. and. Just can't wait. Um, I do have some other manga that I do want to focus on first, so Bleach is probably gonna sit back on the back burner for a while, but definitely excited to get into that. All right, guys, well, that wraps up my pickups for September. Pretty awesome stuff, definitely a lot more than what I thought I was gonna get. Um, hopefully, here pretty soon, I'll have a lot better setup for my videos and get this room all straightened out. As you can see, there's some garbage over there that looks really unsightly, so I am to apologize. But anyway, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you enjoy my channel. If you do, drop a like, leave a comment, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will catch you guys later.